Hey, Stu Crew, John Based out here, and we are going to the big time. New Media Stu got invited to cover the Top Chef finale over at Bravo TV. So, of course, what did I do? I took to Twitter to get your questions for the stars of Bravo. And now it's a webcastic Wednesday, chock full of Bravo celebrities answering your questions. We're going to meet some of the Bravo celebrities on the red carpet, answering your questions with my camera buddy, Eric. Say hello, Eric. Hello. Got the cyber comments card with some of your Stu Crew questions right on the back. Oh, professional. Thank you, Stu Crew. I love you so much. A Star XOX, Ninoized, SG Show, Tay Tay Camp. Someone awesome. Much love and respect to each and every one of you. Thank you so much for making us so popular that we actually get invited to events now. Look where I am, in front of the Watch What Happens Live set with Andy Cohen. This is one of my dreams right here. I'd be sitting right here with Mr. Andy Cohn. Winning. And right now, I'm gonna take you on into the red carpet. Over here, this is the red carpet before everything gets going. It's like a cattle call. But you wanna see the best thing? New media stew right there on the ground. Look at the popularity you've brought us to, Stu Crew. Much love and respect. There we are. It's a lady of her word, and also a lady that I don't have to bend like this to be with. Which, <laughs> Isn't we, we, it nice? It's very nice, actually. <laughs> Very, very nice. The lovely and talented Luann Deliceps. Thank you. Um, you are awesome, by the way. Uh, we love you on New Media Stew. Thank you very much. I oh. love New Media Stew. Who are you wearing, and do you get to keep it? Uh, this is a Terry John dress, and um, I really like it, so I think I'm definitely going to keep it. I bought it, so I get to keep it. I'm wearing Dolce & Gabbana, and I'm wearing Miu Miu shoes and Quiat jewelry. We have the Stew Crew. That's basically the, our audience on New Media Stew. We, we love them. They're called the Stew Crew. They're abandoned nomads, abandoned nuts, just a crazy barrel of monkeys, so I can't take credit for any of their questions. But let's see, they had tweeted in some questions. They want me to ask you, what is your, first of all, this is from Shy Bullwinkle, Happy Moose, on Twitter. What is your favorite guilty pleasure? My favorite guilty pleasure is sleeping later than I should. Chocolate, without a question. My favorite guilty pleasure is Alex McCall. Oh, do I make you feel guilty? Oh, come on. These guys got the shtick down. They're good. Chocolate with almonds and lots yeah. of it. Lots That's of mine. with almonds? Nuts and, nuts and chocolate, baby. Oh. I'm the late night cookies and milk guy. Like 5 a.m., a whole box of cookies and a quart of milk and beat them both down. That was me before Fitness Made Simple. It was the three quarters of an Entenmann's chocolate brownie cake and a big jug of milk, and I wondered why I could never see my abs. Case of success is expect failure, expect to work hard, and never let anyone tell you no. I like that, and now not a Jacqueline? You never give up, never give up, that's the thing. Come here a second, you're too far away from me. I love you. Okay, this is our table flipping princess who I adore. Teresa, what is your key to success? Um, try your hardest every day, get up and, you know, give it all you could. That is awesome. Thank you so much, guys. Much success on the show. Everybody at the Stew Crew, watch Bravo's Housewives of New Jersey. This is from A Star XOX. What is your go-to word that makes you feel the happiest? I don't think I have a go-to word. Um, I, I, I don't tend to think about using words to make me happy um, because, you know, what matters is what you do, not what you say. Actions speak louder. Hallelujah. Oh. <laughs> I was at your other event where you had the bra dress. <laughs> and this is the man responsible for those amazing designs, Mr. Chris March from Blargle. Have you ever had a close encounter? With what? You can take it for what it is, Chris. I've had a close encounter with a lot of celebrities. They're kind of aliens. Grace Helbig. Do we have Grace over here? There's Grace. How would you describe John Basel in two adjectives? Just two. That's all you get. Striking. Ooh. Striking I like is that. Winning. Um, winning. <laughs> Striking is winning. Um, and courteous. Thank you so This is my future wife right here, Miss yeah. Luann Della Seps. I love it. There's Grace. What are the Bravo Liberty spirit animals? What is that raging beast that lives inside of them? 
I'm a chimpanzee. I'm gonna have to go with woodchuck, you know? Like I grew up with a lot of woodchucks hanging out. It's just like they just seem like lazy and they're happy and they don't bother anybody. Nobody really bothers them. I would have to say a dog. Oh, okay. I, I would love to be my dog. I mean, my dog is treated so well that if I was my dog, life would just be cushy. I'd be laying on a king-size bed right now, eating filet mignon, sleeping in feather pillows, and someone like stroking them. Chloe, I love you. <laughs> there you go. I did my job as a good godfather from New Media Stew. Chloe, Michael Isabella from Top Chef. Don't hate, motivate. Don't play a hate, participate. New Media Stew is like a big hot bowl of joy. Get chunked. So you gonna do it? You gonna do it? Hmm?